Hi everyone, thanks for joining me for another tutorial in Melinda's Rubber Room. I'm Melinda Pierce, I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator, and I'm here today to show you how to make this Christmas card. This is one that um, I did at my recent uh, card class in California, Santa Barbara. Um, I also did a card class in the mail. So if you participated in the card class in the mail, I'm going to show you how to put together your cards. So you're first going to stamp the Noel greeting. And I have something stuck on my <laughs> pad, so I'm going to stamp that again. And I'm doing this in shaded spruce. And I'm going to do a few of these all at one time just because I have a bunch of extra card packets. So I'll be ready to make my Christmas cards. And the stamp set that I'm using is the Joy of Noel stamp set. And I'm going to take my die and put that right on top of my cardstock that I just stamped, lining up my image. And this die will cut out all four of those letters all at one time. I'm just going to bring in my mini cut emboss machine. Just cut out one of those for now. You can see all those little letters just pop out nicely. And I already have my so the card kit includes the uh, white cardstock for the base and the shaded spruce layer, as well as the embossed layer that goes on top. So this emboss piece is one of the embossing folders from the basic embossing folders that you can find online. It's an online exclusive and you can find that at um, melindapierce.stampinup.net. And I'm just trying to find my glue. Okay, so I'm just going to attach my white piece that's embossed onto my shaded spruce. I would recommend a glue for this. Um, it is a, quite a textured embossing folder and tape does not seem to want to hold down the embossing folders, uh, the pieces of paper that you run through the embossing folders as nicely as glue does. So if you ever have a embossing an embossed image that's not sticking to your paper, try the glue instead of tape. I'm just taking my shaded spruce piece, putting that right on top. I'm going to take my Noel that I die cut out. And those are just going to be glued on the front of my card. Okay, so now I'm going to take the bow set, uh, the bow stamp, that's this one here, and I'm going to stamp that three times for each of my cards. And then I'll also die cut those out. Okay, so once I have all those colored in, I'm just going to put them over and under each other. So this one is over this one, and this one is going to be over this one and under this one. And I'm just going to form it into a circle or a wreath, just like so. Sorry, this should be over. So it's the, the, the top of the bow should be over 
the previous bow. I'm just going to take a little bit of glue and glue those into place. that. So I'm just going to go ahead and raise that up on dimensionals. And stick it on my card. I want to make sure that I raise it up high enough so that my bow can be attached. So I've already um, tied the bow for you and I'm just going to attach that with uh, some mini glue dots. I'm going to take the bow to the mini glue dot, press it firmly into place, lift it up, and stick it. <laughs> Easier said than done. Lift it up and stick it into place just like so and then on the inside of my card i have a greeting this says making spirits bright that's just going to be stamped on the inside with this shaded spruce again Just like so there's that completed card so stay tuned to my next video and i'll show you the um the other two cards that we made thank you bye, -bye.